light flyweight semifinal against Victor Casotti of Zambia a few moments ago, but came up short. It's a classy boxer who admits he was beaten, and Dominic, I guess you'd have to make that concession. Yeah, um, I, I gave it everything I had. You know, I've been uh, more ready for this tournament than any other tournament, but uh, he was on me today. I guess they watched the tapes. They knew what to do, and, uh, you know, he, he beat me. That's so it was. Breaks of the draw when he come up against maybe the toughest fighter in the class in the semifinal. I'm guessing that the semifinal that's on behind us right now, either of these boxers you could have beaten, but that's no consolation, is it? So any boxer can be beaten any given day, and uh, it's just the way it goes. These two guys, they don't look as good as this guy, but uh, it's the, the, the breaks. Um, I'm happy with my draw. Um, you know, I've got no, no regrets. I've trained for this, like I told you, 110%, gave it all, gave it my all, and that's it. Well, bronze in consecutive Commonwealth Games, one in Auckland, another one here, and there's not a lot of fighters who can claim that. No, no, but uh, I, I just, like I said, I gave it my best, and uh, I would have liked to add a gold to that little collection of mine, but uh, that's the way it goes. All right, Dominic, you did give it your all, and uh, congratulations Thanks. once again. Can I say hi to everybody back in Scriber, Ontario, my family and friends, and all the guys in the gym in Toronto? Is it, is See you when late? I get home. Is it too late for me to say you can't say hi? No. No, you've already done it. <laughs> okay. Congratulations, <laughs> Dominic. Thanks for joining us. But uh, six more.